tangent. Uh, oh, because um, when you left is negative one, mm -hmm. and that's how he goes out of space. And that explains the left, right? But how about if he's standing still, right? Why is he disappearing when he's standing still? Hmm. Oh, because it only turns positive when he moves right. So that means he only comes into picture when he's moving right. I like that, right? Anyone want to take a guess? Ben, Hayden, Alex? Yeah, what are you doing? <laughs> right, I'll explain it to you right now, right? Look at it carefully. When we press right, right speed is equal to one, right? Which we do this and then we draw it, right? Does it make sense to everyone? But the yeah. key word here is that we draw him right here, right? How about if we go left? Do you do anything? Well, we did nothing. So his left is obviously not going to be drawn. Does that make sense so far, Ben, Tom, yeah. and Alex? So since we didn't draw him, which is this over here, well, he's obviously not going to, he's not going to appear in our game. That explains our left. But how about our standing still, right? Think about it this way, though. Standing still, what speed is he at? Is he a positive or a negative? He's at zero. He's at zero, right? Do we have code here for what his speed is zero? We have one for no. positive. We have one for negative, but known for zero, right? So obviously, yeah. we're not drawing him at zero either, so that's why he is disappearing. Does that make sense? Dun, dun, dun. Right, so what we're going to do next is we're actually going to finish at least the left animation first. So let's do that next, and then after that, we'll do the idle animation. Okay, guys, I'm excited for you guys. So here's what we're going to do.